because Grand Theft Auto Six is also on the corner, right? Uh, let's yeah. talk about that. Uh, Vinay, uh, you know, Grand Theft Auto Six. The trailer is finally out. Uh, we are all blown away. Uh, a lot of people uh, have started speculating on what's uh, going to happen, what's not going to happen. So, what is something that you personally, as a gamer, are excited about uh, GTA Six? And the second part, in addition to that, is what do you think might have been the development challenges that Rockstar might have potentially gone through to create such a masterpiece? Yeah, it's it's crazy, right? Uh, that I don't think there's a single piece of uh, media, right, including movies and games that have been as famous or as uh, money making as Grand Theft Auto Five, right? Some statistic I read in twenty uh, twenty or something said uh, GTA Five surpassed. Uh, the box office collections of Spider-Man, Avengers, everything combined. And it's, it's just a behemoth, uh, you know, stuff that uh, culturally speaks to everyone. So I think Grand Theft Auto 6 is just going to be uh, insanely, uh, you know, uh, way more, uh, like we've seen the trailer, it, it looks insane. Honestly, I looked at it and, uh, you know, we messaged in the group also saying, how the hell do you achieve this, guys? And... Uh, like if you look at the graphics and uh, it's all real time and that's what's mind blowing that rockstar has achieved something so incredible which is running real time recently also there have been these rumors that uh, it's going to be uh, you know running on the ps5 pro and there's been this to and fro already chatter going on about how uh, ps5 pro might not even support it at uh, you know 60 fps it'll be at 30 fps and stuff so that's how heavy it is and i think one of the biggest challenges they have is to even match the success of gta 5 just as a game developer, if you look at it, how do you uh, follow up GTA 5 and make it as big as a cultural phenomena, right? Uh, so that's the, I think from Roxas perspective, that's like the biggest fear saying, I hope we don't screw this up because uh, we really need to, because I think we know that there are so many like critics, uh, you know, especially YouTube critics that are there who will pick on the smallest thing and like, you know, make a huge deal about it. So I think just from an expectation perspective, I really hope Rockstar is able to like deliver. I think they will because they're Rockstar. They've taken that time. Uh, that's one major thing. And I think another development challenge is, again, uh, just seeing the graphics and uh, what they've achieved, right? As game developers, we look at it and like, they must be doing some kind of like magic, right? It's like, how are they achieving stuff? So uh, that is a huge thing. Developmentally, I think uh, just... Uh, having a lot of outsourcing partners and working with huge, uh, massive teams to, uh, you know, develop the game and also kind of keep it secret, right? Uh, imagine it for it. Uh, some of the footage already leaked and stuff, so they faced a lot of uh, battles that way. But I think it's fine. It's I, Rockstar probably takes it as you know part of the whole uh, marketing of uh, you know how big Rockstar is. We're so cool that you know we are so big. And there, I remember there's a uh, like a discussion between Linda Yakarino on X and also of like, why are you putting your video on YouTube, put it on X so you get more views. So it's like a cultural phenomenon that uh, I think I just want to uh, just go through this journey of discovering what GTA 6 is and just experience the good, the highs and the lows and then how GTA Online is kind of going to shape up with regards to, you know, GTA 6. Yeah. So that that's, yeah, it, it's, it's very exciting. <laughs> Yeah, 100%. And I think uh, GTA has established themselves in that small category wherein they are a household name, not just in the uh, tongues of uh, or the lingo of kids, but also parents. Parents are like concerned. And, uh, you know, even if they don't know all the other games, they do know at least GTA. Even if they don't know like the full form of GTA, they know GTA, that my kid is playing GTA and this is happening and all. So that's something that they've achieved uh, and, uh, you know, it's it's difficult to do that. And this is a, a work of almost 30 odd years, right? 30 plus years that they've pulled through. Uh, 